Okay, we're back on, and it is Lavatnia Moralitumi's turn. Lavatnia Moralitumi Dumi, and uh, let's see what you got. So, Levao Strauss, Lamat Deralatuli. All right, here we are. My graphic design journey started 11 years ago as a hobby, something much, much more. Wow really nice it's very simple and elegant and um, very clear it's a good choice of websites to use template wise it's uh, very sophisticated but also it makes your the colors pop in your actual designs so yes I'm so happy to see that when I click on that it enlarges and I can scroll through images and I can really get a sense of your design work uh, very cool nice work I like this course examples a couple examples of my work your text is really good too um, I like that you spent, took the time to write very clear and concise cohesive content and gives us a sense about who you are and how to get in touch with you. So you could send the message. And uh, I think this is a good site. Um, let's see the original template. Dun dun dun. And see how and what sorts of changes you made. And you know, I don't know if any of you watch American Idol. I actually don't. But I remember back in the day, one of the big things was song choice that was the thing they talked about a lot so I think finding the right template is really important um, you can design sites from scratch you can find templates that work for you and change them all up so that they're yours and publish them uh, there's also Wix and you know you name it there's Squarespace and all these things uh, but I, I do think that selecting the template that fits your design the best is actually really important so as I see the original site and I see yours I can see the sorts of changes that you made um, you've changed the color you've kept things fairly similar and I think that the site that you've decided the template itself allows for that um, and so you know, a good job on picking the right template. I mean, it's hard to say. I think this template is so strong that, like, making changes to the background colors and stuff probably wouldn't have done, helped you out much. But you did make changes when you felt it was necessary. I feel like this is very thoughtful changes and things are very essential. So, nice work. Uh, I hope you enjoyed learning about HTML and CSS and looks like you as a designer this is part of your journey so well done all right let's keep going um, where are we next all right Lavaccia Morale Tutti good job and we are on to Martini Martinelli's Martinelli's apple cider you are up Okay, Leonis Martinonis, exploring the relationship between the physical and the immaterial worlds through art. Okay, boom, things are working. Immediately, commission time. Let's do it. Let's make some money. Physical versus immaterial. I also like the way that you wrote clearly and, and thoughtfully about your site, your work and the things that you're pursuing in your work. This is all very important things to do. Did you by chance use the same site that we just saw? Let's take a look. You sure did. Okay, so good. We get to see the sort of changes that you made. Let's go back to this site. Again, I think the template is a, is a solid choice and you as well have have kept some things the same 
and changed some things depending on what you felt was necessary. You enlarged your name, changed the text size. This background image is, is less subtle, more pronounced and powerful, and that plays off of the images that you chose to, to use. Uh, change some things here very nice change some things here boom nice work I like that that's pretty awesome too and then again you always want these images <coughs> excuse me so weird teaching online courses. I would never sneeze like that in a room full of people. But I feel like I'm in my house by myself right now, just my dog and I. But it is real, so I apologize for that. Excuse me. Um, definitely some allergies happening. In an earlier video, I had a tortilla chip stuck in my throat, so this was not as bad. Uh, looks like you changed the contact page color a little bit send message you put send message same thing but anyway nice nice choice of design you change the background image in your footer and changed uh, some things here so this is a good very solid site I like it this image in the front is a little little heavy uh, might be nice to use one of these you know I could imagine one of those back there but it's very bright. Um, so, nice job. Leonis Martonis. I'm impressed. You've done a good job in this class, and I hope you've enjoyed it. Congratulations on learning the fundamentals. You definitely can keep going from there. All right, let's see where we're at. We are at Minyatas Pachakas. Minyatas Pachakadubis. It's your turn. Let's see what we have. Well, you're welcome. Thank you for visiting new perspectives. That That's nice. Uh, okay. So this site is pretty unique, I must say. I really wish these worked. Let me bring this into brackets to make sure that it's not the browser not picking it up maybe this will help no would have been nice to see those links working the contact link works oh so close but it's okay it's an intro course you're working on it you're learning you got some pretty creative things happening here with your site uh, because I've looked at it before and you scroll down you get these really interesting things that you're working on here do you you make these I'm wondering you can't answer me because this is sort of a one-way video but I'm imagining that these are your creations and they are really cool so very nice I'm clicking I'm clicking and clicking I really want to see these bigger so if there's a way to hack into that site create external pages or link two pages in your site would be awesome okay I'm not sure what's going on up here this is all so tiny but it goes to a Facebook page I don't know if this is where it's supposed to take me but it's there uh, I want to see what the original site looks like Wow so they also the original site Ooh, I saw this kind of a, a leftover on your site uh, gotta be careful with that sort of thing let's see if their links work they don't either so that's where you you picked a dud of a template when it comes to that menu bar that's so ridiculous none of these work uh, okay let's keep moving this is absurdly small I have to say I think the template that you chose did not do you justice it's 
not the strongest template and these don't really link to anything and this is all crunched up into the all right, I would send Toolplate a message and tell them that 2079 Garage is deprecated. Deprecated is a term in web design that means it's no longer use, use, useful in the sense that it's just not working anymore. It's deprecated. Uh, but anyway, I can tell that you've made a lot of changes and you're learning how to code and use web design so Menenos Pacheco Pachica good job all right Papalooza it is your turn let's see what we have going on here all right Paul Papazzi's imagery photography graphic design visual marketing I recognize this. This is the artist template. Another good choice, okay? I, I think your site's really strong. I think this image is soft in the background. I think it's a really good choice. I think you're letting us know what this is all about. These could be links and you can make that happen with code. It might be nice if I hover that, that I can go to the photography, graphic design, etc. Um, all in all, let's keep things going here. One stop shop about me, okay? It's a very professional site, and uh, you work at the Recreational Wellness doing graphic design. Awesome, love that place. And so, this is a good site. Uh, you're utilizing the template to get the most out of it. Interesting photos. Rec well, so it's showing your stuff, and I also like this aspect. Let's get back to this in your work samples. So you have this sort of links up in here in your images, but your resume here's a list of skills and positions I have held in my professional career. Um, just a little resume tip I would make, make this more proactive. Here is a list of skills and positions that I instead of have held maybe you talk about now here is my current resume here is a current list of skills and positions that I am involved with or something and there's a way to, to phrase that I'm not doing the best job of it but you want you want people to know that you're it's not things that just what you've done in the past but what you're doing if that makes sense but anyway let's I wish you could click on this and get to the resume and maybe you can double click where's the link ooh look here it is there it goes it doesn't work there but it works here that's interesting and there it is very nice this would be a great spot that you can have a PDF I think level 21 or one of those levels you learn how to create an external PDF that's what you want right here you want this to open up as an external PDF so that people can print it or share it with others and see it full size. See, I can't really get this any larger. I might be able to put, drag it into my desktop, which is kind of nice, but yeah, I guess that kind of works, but not many people are gonna, gonna do that. Very solid looking resume, pretty impressive. I am excited. You're doing a great job. You're learning your code. And um, I'm hoping that you, you can apply this in a way that helps you reach your goals, whatever they may be. All right. Uh, Richelli, Eagletown, you're up next, but we're going to do that in the next video.